When a company has a high inventory turnover ratio, it will have a low number of days sales sitting in inventory. If it has a low inventory turnover ratio, it will have a high number of days sales of inventory. The days sales of inventory ratio effectively says, if we stop buying inventory today, how many days will it take us to sell up all of our remaining inventory? Let's assume that two banana retailers, Brown Banana Co. and Yellow Banana Co. had inventory turnover ratios of 5 and 60, respectively. Assuming bananas ripen within one week of being picked, which company's management appears to be doing a horrible job at getting the bananas sold before they overripen and have to be thrown away? Which of the two companies is probably on the quickest path to failure because of its inability to efficiently and effectively manage its banana purchases and sales? As with the AR turnover ratio, a company's day's sales of inventory is computed by dividing 365 by the number of times the company turns its inventory over each year. Brown Banana Co. has 73 days sales of inventory on hand, 365 days per year divided by 5 inventory turnover ratio. Yellow Banana Co. has 6.08 days sales of inventory on hand, 365 days per year divided by 60 inventory turnover ratio. Per the computations above, Brown Banana Co. needs 73 days to sell its bananas, whereas Yellow Banana Co. only needs 6 days to sell its bananas. Yellow's shorter day sales of inventory indicates that its management is able to more quickly get its bananas sold to customers. By selling its inventory more quickly, as compared to Brown, Yellow will probably be more able to sell its bananas before they turn brown, sell its bananas at full price, lower its inventory carrying costs, and increase liquidity to pay off current liabilities when they come due.